For this video po, ang ating tatalakayan ay ito po sa complementary and, and supplementary angle. That's type, two types of angle pairs. No? Um, number one, we have complementary angle. So, in complementary angle, uh, two angles called complementary when the measures add to 90 degrees. So, ang ibig sabihin naman po, patatawag po natin complementary angle, ang dalawang angle, kapag ang angle 1 and angle 2, uh, pinag-add natin at ang sum nila is 90 degree. Okay? Like for example, number 1. Itong angle 1, this is angle 1. Let's say this is angle 1. This is angle 2. So, angle 1, angle 1 measures 40 degree. Angle 2 measures 50 degree. So, pag inad po natin siya, 90 degree. So, that's complementary angle. Next. Kung mapapansin nyo, right angle siya, no? Yan, no? So, kapag right angle, dapat ang value niya is 90 degree pag pinag-add. Itong angle 1 and angle 2. So, for this example, Let's find val the angle M. Let's find the value of angle M. Okay? So, this is, right this is right angle. So, right angle measures 90 degrees. So, we have 90 degrees. And we have this angle 2, which is 52 degrees. Pag minus lamang po natin yan. So, we have, we have 38. Okay? Angle M measures or equal to 38 degrees. Okay. Okay. So, for this example, let's find angle E. This is, this is right angle. So, this is um, equivalent to 90 degree. No? And then, 65, yung available na value. Minus lang natin yan. Ang sagot is 25. So, angle E is equals to 6. Um, 25 degree. Paano natin malalaman na tama yung sagot natin? Add lang natin tong 65 at itong angle E natin. So, very 90. So, kapag 90 yung lumabas, tama yan. Basta, complementary angle. Okay, example number 3. We have right angle again. Now, complementary pa rin. So, complementary is 90 degree. Is equal to 90 degree. And then, 63 minus lang natin yan. 27. So, this is equal to 27 degree. Yan lang. Na-check natin kung tama ba yung sagot natin. 0, 0, 9. So, tama ang sagot natin. Paano naman po kapag ganto yung lumabas sa exam? No? Ang gagawin lamang po natin dyan para pumabali natin ito, mahanap natin yung value ng angle na ito at saka angle na ito is ilagay lamang po natin ito dito 2x plus 7x minus 9. So, this is uh, right angle. So, ilagay natin dito value ng right angle is 90 degree. So, pagsamahin lang natin, 2x plus 7x, 9x minus 9 is equals to 90 pa rin, plus 9, plus 9, para makancel itong 9. And then, this is, this will become 99, 9x. So, ang kailangan natin, uh, maging x lang to, no? Hindi natin to kailangan. So, para mawala itong 9, divide natin siya by 9, no? both sides by 9, x na lang siya. And then, 11, yung sagot natin. Yung sagot natin. X yung... Okay, substitute lamang natin tong X, no? 2 times 11 is equals to 22. 7 times 11 minus 9 is equals to ilan? 68. So, 22 plus 68 is equals to 9. Tama. Itong side na to, 
is equals to 22 degree. Itong side na ito naman is equals to 68 degree. Okay, sana malinaw yon. Next example, example number 2. Ganun pa rin gagawin natin. 13 plus 11x is equals to 90. Saan ko ito na 90? Right angle po siya. So, ang right angle is equals to 90. Okay? So, kailangan uh, mawala itong 13. So, minus natin ito by 13. And then, pag minus tayo dito ng 13, pag minus din tayo dito ng 13. Huh? So, 11x na lang. Ilan na lang ang sagot? Ilan na lang ang natira? So, ilan, lang, ilan na lang ang natira? 77 na lang. So, divide natin ito by 11 kasi ayaw natin may katabi ang 11, ang x. So, this will go back to cancel. x na lang. And then, 77 divided by 11 is equals to 7. So, ang x niya is equals to 7. Tingnan natin kung tama yung sagot natin. 13 ito. Ang angle number 1 is 13. Angle number 2 is 11 times 7 is equals to 77. So, 77 plus 13 is equals to 90. So, tama ang sagot natin. Ayaw nga pala. Para mas madali yung matandaan yung complementary at supplementary. No, para mas madali ang kayo. Ito, complementary and this is supplementary. So, ang value dapat ng dalawang angle pag pinag plus is 90 degree. No? Yan. Degree. Complementary yan. Yan yung complementary. So, sa supplementary naman, dapat 180 degree. Okay. Kita nyo. Yan yung C. Ilagay lang tayo dito ng linya. Para mag... Para... Meron tayo ditong 9. So, kapag 90, complementary yun. Kapag... Lumabas naman yung 8, supplementary yun. Okay? Supplementary when the measures add up to 180 degrees. So... Sabi daw, kapag ang dalawang angle ay pinag plus at ang magiging sum is 180, ito po ay supplementary angle. Okay? Supplementary angle. Okay? So, ito po yung example ng supplementary angle. 91 plus 89 is equals to 180 degree. Okay, next, this angle. No? So, may kita natin, no? supplementary ito. 140, ay 180, kasi supplement, ang value dapat ng supplementary is 180 minus 140. Parang ginawa lang natin na ganito sa supplementary. Okay, 40 ang sagot. So, ang value na ito po is... 40 degrees. Maghahanap po tayo ng value na kapag pinag-add sa 140, ang magiging sagot is 80. Okay po ba? Okay, another example. 140 po, we have 145. 180 minus 145 is equals to ilan? 35. So, this Angle H is equals to 35 degree. Okay. Next. We have 79 degree. So, we need to find the um, measurement of angle K. Now we need to find the... So, we have 180 degree because supplementary siya. And 79. Minus lamang natin yan. This will become 10, this will become 7, 1, 0, 1. So, angle K is equals to 101 degree. Okay, we need to find the angle 
M and L. So, parang katulad lang ng ginawa natin kaganina sa complementary. Lagi lang natin dito yung 136 plus X plus 4 is equals to 180. Sa so, kutunan ko ang 180, 180 siya kasi supplementary. 140 plus X, 180 naman ito. Eh, ilipat natin ito dito or minus 140. Cancel, cancel. Pag nung minus tayo dito, mag-minus din tayo rito ng 140. Um, this will become 40. And then, may natira pa tayong X. Okay. So, ang value po ng X natin is 40. Tama po ba? So, try natin. We have 40. Dito sa, ito ah. We have 40. Value ng X, 40 plus 4. equals to 44. So, we have the value of M and L in M and L is equals to 44 and the value of K and M is equals to 136 degree. So, kapag pinag-add natin itong dalawa, 44 plus 136 degree, ang magiging sagot is 180 degree. So, tama.